It with graphic video detailing seven-year-old Pernoy Bhattacharya's final moments. The video shows Pernoy with his mother, father, and younger brother attempting to cross the street. And prosecutors allege the family was signaled to cross just seconds before this off-road vehicle plowed through a red light, striking Pernoy. And prosecutors claim the suspect, Sergio Almanza, was behind the wheel with three passengers intoxicated and driving at high rates of speed when he hit Pernoy. Now, Pernoy was thrown in the air, as you can see in that video, from the impact of that canyon, about 56 feet before he landed on Central Avenue. He hit the ground and skid over another 100 feet. After you hear all of this evidence, the state will have proved to you that this defendant was impaired by alcohol. He takes responsibility before you today unequivocally. No excuses. You may ask why a trial, which is a legitimate question today. And here's their answer. We believe the evidence will not support an impairment case, a DWI case. And to emphasize the defense's statement there, they say while Almanza will admit to being guilty of killing Pernoy, injuring Pernoy's father and leaving the scene, they are fighting the claim that Almanza was driving drunk.